A very wonderful morning to my esteemed listener. I am Jemi Grisman Aduluju, lead pastor, Lighthouse International Christian Center, Samanda UI Road, Ibadan, Nigeria, welcoming you to today's edition of our program, Daily Impact. We are just coming out of a wonderful 10 days at Shiloh program where we saw the manifestation of the power, the grace, the glory, and the ability of God in our lives and in our destinies. For 10 days, we were receiving great revelations and impartation for manifestations in life and in destiny. Infallible proofs, God demonstrating and manifesting his glory and greatness in our lives. And this Monday morning, I like to declare and decree the release of the blessings and some of the blessings that were released upon us during this great program. In the name that is above all names, and I am declaring that this week, God will cause heavens to open upon your life. Heavens will open upon you, and the Lord will command his voice upon your life, upon your destiny, upon your business. Just as God commanded the people to hear his son Jesus, situations, circumstances, people are, are commanded to hear you. And so from this day forward, men will hear you. Situations will hear you. Your business will hear you. The heavens will hear you. The heart will listen to you. The heart will support you. The heart will defend you. And the name of the Lord will be glorified in your life and in your destiny. I declare this week that the presence of the Lord will go with you and that God will give you proofs that cannot be denied. God will give you evidences of great impact in your life and in your destiny. God will do things in your life that will put an end to every argument to the praise of his name. Infallible proofs are proofs that give you a brighter future Infallible proofs are proofs that ends all arguments. All arguments will end in your life by reason of the proofs and the things that God will make happen for you. The word of God was also declared upon us, and I am declaring that word concerning you, that the Lord will cause your life and destiny to be divinely elevated, and God will make you his proof, the proof of his power the proof of his greatness, the proof of his glory in the precious name of Jesus. I declare by the spirit of the living God that doors will open for you, doors of breakthrough, doors of favor all round. Financial doors will open to the praise of the name of the Lord. I declare it is your season of manifestation. God will give you a place, a place for manifestation in life, and in destiny, you will be given a place to manifest, and the name of the Lord will be honored. And because you are planted in the courts of God, you will flourish in his court. This week, therefore, is your week of flourishing, your week of divine enlargement to the praise of the name of the Lord, in the name of Jesus. You will have something great to show in the name of Jesus, and everything, every power, every force, every voice, that has been challenging the authority of God in your life, they are totally subdued. Powers holding on to what belongs to you are commanded to release it to you in the precious name of Jesus. The grace of God will sustain you. The power of God will be released upon your life and upon your destiny. Today, I command every angry promise over your life and destiny to come to manifestation, to come to fulfillment in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I declare by the Spirit of the living God that the counsel of God, the promises of God, the purpose of God for you will find expressions. Where you have been tied, you are released. Where your blessings have been tied, they are released. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, you begin to gather blessings, blessings that will not be numbered. Blessings that cannot be numbered to the glory of the name of the Lord. In Genesis chapter 41, verse 49, the Bible says, And Joseph gathered corn as the sand of the sea very much until he left numbering 
for it was without number. Again, I declare that this week you will gather blessings that without that are without number. In the name of Jesus, you will have a great collection of blessings like the sand of the ocean that you will not be able to number. You will finally quit keeping track of your blessings in the name of Jesus. You will quit keeping track of the blessings of God, of the greatness and the glory and the beauty of God upon your life. You will gather much blessings that are without measure, without number, that, that is impossible to measure to the praise of of the glory of the name of the Lord. And all this will happen by the word of God upon your life, upon your destiny. The heavens are open. The Lord will rend the heavens. He will rend the heavens and he will cause unexpected miracles and blessings to happen for you with ease in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. God will become an adversary to your adversaries. He will fight against those who fight against you and he will bless those who bless you and curse those who curse you in the name of Jesus. His presence will accompany you throughout this year, throughout this coming year and throughout your life and destiny. His presence will swallow every mountain on your path in the name of Jesus. The God of Shiloh will cause the heart to open for you the earth will open for you and blessings will flow to you. Your ground will bring forth plentifully because the heart is open unto you. The God of Shiloh will cause doors to open for you. Revelations 3, 8 said, I have set before you an open door and no man shall be able to shut it. The God of Shiloh will cause amazing doors to open for you. Doors will open. No power will be able to shut the door that God opens for you. There are many doors, doors of blessings, doors of opportunities, doors of promotion, doors of progress, doors of advancement and prosperity. We open for you in the name of Jesus. For every womb that is trusting God for a fruit, that womb will be open in the name of Jesus. Openings command miracles. So we ask that miracles be commanded and be directed on your path and towards you because your womb is open. Your grave shall be opened. In Ezekiel 37 from verse 10 to verse 12, God said, My people, I will open your graves. I declare that every grave that has swallowed up your blessings be open to vomit them to you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Wherever your blessings are, let them be released to you now. Let the graves open. The grave that swallowed Lazarus, open up and vomited him and released him. I command the grave that has swallowed you up, swallowed up your blessings and destiny to open up and release you in the name of Jesus. Your gates will open. Great gates will open. Iron gates that lead to your city of joy and greatness and glory will open for you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Every locked up destiny in prison the prison doors, the prison gates will open. Your destiny will be liberated. For you, the God of Shiloh, will cause windows of blessings to open. I will open the windows of heaven, says God, and I will pour you blessings that you will not be able to contain. You will not have enough room to contain the blessings of God. These are the blessings of Shiloh. God will open great windows of blessings for you, windows of opportunities. God will open for you. In the name of Jesus, your field is open and great blessings will flow from your field. Your endeavors will produce amazing results in the name of Jesus. This very week beginning, you begin to see blessings that you have never seen before because the God of Shiloh will make all this happen. This will happen by reason of the mercy of the Almighty God, not because you are deserving, but because it has pleased God to show you mercy. May he please the God of Shiloh, the God of heaven, to show you mercy. May the Lord reveal himself to you again as he did to Samuel in Shiloh. May the Lord reveal himself to you by the word of the Lord. So God will reveal himself to you by his word. The word of God is powerful. The word of God is active. The word of God is productive. So the word of God will work great wonders in your life to the praise of the glory of his name. You will see the God of Shiloh working for you and you will have testimonies to share to the honor of his name. It will begin today. It will start this week. 
they will have blessings and testimonies to share to the honor of the God of Shiloh. Infallible proofs shall be your experience and portion in the name of Jesus. While others are sharing testimonies of infallible proofs, you will not share stories. You will have testimonies to share also, and God will be honored. You will not shed tears while others are testifying. These words will find fulfillment and expression in your life and in your destiny. And so shall it be. The God of heaven will put his stamp of approval on the world. You will see the manifestations. This word will work and happen for you speedily to the praise of the honor of his name. In Jesus' precious name we have prayed. Amen. Support daily impact with grace man. Support with your prayers. Support by forwarding this message and sharing this link with your contacts. Support also financially. Your financial donations can be sent to the Zenith Bank account number 12161004560. The account name is Daily Impact with Grace Man. The Lord bless you as you do. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on other social media platforms. My handle is at Yemi Grace Man. Until I come your way again tomorrow for another exciting edition of our program. I am Jeremy Grisman Adulogu, wishing you a very glorious week of infallible proofs. The Lord bless you.